hey guys welcome to the first video of my channel as per your demand i came out with this video that how to create this animation in after effect like other big creators do in their video so let's get into the video first we have to make a new project and try this in new composition and rename it to animation and whatever you want press ok so first we have to create a grid background for that we have to click we have to right click on this press on new go to the solid and make sure the solid is greater than the composition size like uh, my composition size is 1920 by 1080 p so the solid size should be greater than my composition size okay press ok and for the grid background we'll go effect in effect tab right tab go in general section and click on this grid and to make it look we will go in size and form this drag down this corner point and apply this with an height slider and make width to 145 Yes, 145 and height will be 120 will be. and make opacity to 30 and to look and to make this a uh, background more good we will add some vignette and make its radius to like 700 perfect and now to create the animation first we have to make a new composition and rename it, it to uh, lab animation and select uh, this text by pressing ctrl t and type zero dollar place it over there and make this to that and now for the line animation you have to grab this pen tool and click over here and click over here like this and like i have made it the dashes and gaps in the line for that you have to open the properties of shape tools go in content shape stroke and you can see dashes click on this plus icon so you can see a dashes and to uh, get a gaps so you have to click on this plus icon again you can see dash and gaps both two options uh, make dashes like 21 and to make round you can see over there line cap change but change butt cap from round cap and make dashes like 54 and increase the gap between that um, dash it should be yes this uh, dash it should be 37 37 will be perfect and gap will be 26 and to animate this line you have to open the shape properties click on add go to trim parts and open the properties of trim path and you can see this end and start so at the first frame uh, end will be at zero make a keyframe go few frames forward and make end positive 100 and now it's look like this it seems like it's very fast so we will go few frames forward and put this 
to make it so like this and we will also animate this text for animation open the text properties click on animate go to position add properties and open this opacity position will be 36 opacity will be 0 open this range selector at the starting uh, make an offset of negative 100 make a keyframe go few frames forward and make this positive 100 now go in advanced option make shape from square to ramp up look like this okay now to look affect more good uh, we have to add some camera movement but first we have to put glow in it to look more good so search for deep glow and click on this required for text and make its exposure to like minus uh, 0.50 Copy this glow setting and paste on the shape layer and make its exposure to 0 0.34. Now go to the main composition and click on this project so you can see map animation. Drag down so you can see this. Right. To animate this effect we have to add some camera movement for that we have to make this layer 3d and right click over here new make a camera and we will open this two views so it will make a lot easier to adjust the position of camera go to transformation and make a keyframe of point of interest and position at the starting go few frames forward and make this uh, make this camera move down like this so this will look like this i think it's too much This will be perfect. Yes. Now the text I have added over here, I turned seven dollar per day. For that, uh, we have to make a new composition again. <clears throat> Rename it to text. And now press Control T for text. Type twenty seven dollar and change its color to yellow and make a duplicate of this text by pressing ctrl d and position it down and make it per day and change its color to white perfect scale it little down and position it over here and also we have to animate this text for animation open this text property go in animate click on position add property opacity position will be 36 opacity will be 0 range selector at the starting offset will be negative 100 make a keyframe go a few frames forward make offset to positive 100 go in advance option shape change to ramp up so this is the image so to save your time we have we will copy this animator one and paste paste in it and press U to check all the keyframes 
and make it a little bit forward so it should look like this and we will add some e glow to make this effect look good exposure will be 0 0.33 copy this deep glow paste on this and now go to our main composition and go to the project and you can see this text composition so drag and drop over here and we will select one view and we will select active camera one and click on fit now where it's come to like this you have to like put our text layer over here and position it to somewhere here scale it down we have to go more of it for that we will open two views again camera we will set our camera movement little bit down so our text can easily animate and now it's look good So here is the animation which I made in my videos like this you can see it like this I hope you learned something new from this video if you guys want more tutorial like this so make sure to subscribe my channel and comment down below that on which topic do you want next video